FCA with tips for your mass gift giving situations. Whether you know a bunch of people who have birthdays and anniversaries around the same time, or it's Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, Christmas, Ranma, if, if you exchange gifts in Ranma, tell me my Islamic friends. Anyway, tips number one is save your boxes. Boxes. Save them. They can get expensive otherwise. Even And rectangular prisms are so much easier to wrap. I also recommend saving these. Toothpaste boxes. FCA, what are we using toothpaste boxes for? Like this. This is um, like a body spray. And it's not a present, so I don't mind showing it. And it fits right in there. You can fit bubbles, um, silly string, that weird spray stuff with glitter. It fits in here. You can hide stuff in plain sight. Plus, it's fun on Christmas. It's like, you got me toothpaste? No, open the box. So that's exciting. Another thing you can do is talk about it with your friends and your significant other. You know, are we exchanging gifts? I don't know. Do you want to? And it's a simple way of knowing whether or not you guys are exchanging gifts so there's no awkwardness or anything like that. And it's perfectly acceptable to talk about it because otherwise how are you going to know? Um, you can pick names out of a hat with your friends or your family, you know, whatever. You know, put all of your names into a hat or a bowl and pick it out and then you all buy for whoever's name is on the package. You know, each person buys for that one person. You know, it's caring without breaking the bank. Um, another thing you can do is homemade. Homemade is amazing. Do not be afraid to do homemade. That is so great. Because, you know, that is somebody putting time and effort and thought into what would you like? How should I make this? What should I make? Kind of a thing. And it's all about you or you are doing it all for this other person. And that means so much. Like even cards, homemade cards, you know, they that's all you. That That was entirely you. Um, for you or you know from you about that other person it means so much don't be afraid of homemade and if you have people in your life who are too good for homemade presents then you don't need in, them in your life they don't deserve your love and caring and thought um, also like if you have friends or the extended family who have you know children and married whatnot do the do family gifts you know, like those big Hershey bars or uh, those giant hot cocoa boxes. You know, they have like four cups and different hot chocolates or different teas. Those giant popcorn boxes. Um, a couple movies. You know, just do family stuff. that That's giving without giving too much money. You know, and it's just that we're not made of money. The economy is not great. Why not? Then the other thing you can do is... Um, Split up gifts to get blah, 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 gift packs. Um, a lot of things like perfume, lotions, colognes, stuff like that. You can get packets of them. Um, hair care products, and you know, just instead of you know giving the whole pack to one person, you can split up the pack um, to multiple people. And I like doing that for like colognes and stuff because that's really sweet because I because like each one has its own little description and you're like oh this really sounds like this person this really sounds like this person because when you give somebody especially if it's somebody you know in a long time a gift pack sometimes I feel like I'm telling them I don't know you very well so here's a bunch of random stuff and I hope you like some of them but if you like choose one specific thing um, out of the gift pack it's like oh this one was so you and this one was so you, and it's giving again without giving all the money. Uh, it's remember, it's not about the materials; it's about the thought and the care, and you know, sharing and love of joy, and you know, being with the people you care about. Um, and Jesus's birthday for us Christians. Um, also, if you want more variety to give to people, you can buy little samples. Um, I know Sephora, they, they're just who I thought off the top of my head. They give samples like this, and they give a lot of them. So you can, you know, give the person variety. So if it's like a girlfriend or a boyfriend who you kind of know, but, you know, you've been dating a while, but you're not quite sure about scents and things, these are, are perfect because it lets them pick out stuff that they do like so they can get the big one or they can tell you the big one that they want, you know, for a later 
gift or whatnot. And these are just little things, you know, 1.5 ounces and 0.4 ounces. Um, not ounces, I mean milliliters. And, you know, it works. Um, yeah, that's all I have. I hope these little tips help you spread the joy without spreading your wallet too far. And happy anything you celebrate. If you celebrate and, you know, happy gift giving. Happy gift giving, everybody. Bye.